I'm in a bind right now. I'm in a bind. I'm in a bind trying to make it to my destination. I gotta get the way I'm going. In order to get the way I'm going, I gotta get the way I'm at. Oh, Jesus, be a fit, sign it. Oh no, calm it down, buddy, calm it down. Welcome to, wait, wait. Welcome to an episode of Cuzzo AB Shenanigans, y'all. So, what up? <laughs> I missed y'all. Drop it a vlog, drop it a vlog, drop it a vlog, drop it a vlog, drop all that good old stuff, y'all. All right, y'all. Cleveland Cuzzo is back. Y'all already know the vibes. When I get to Cleveland, I act like a whole new person. I act like, <laughs> baby, the world don't exist. Yes, I do. Skin glowing, got my hair done all this well. So, welcome back to the channel, y'all. I just spit. It's cool. But, all right, I'm in a bind right now. I'm in a bind. I done ran to the mall. I done got, girl, I done went to work. I done went and recorded a video. I done did everything except charge the car. A Tesla don't work like no regular car. You can't just pull over to no gas station hollering, I know my car. You don't know your car. You don't. Not a Tesla. So I was 28 minutes away. Didn't realize I was away from a supercharger. And I was 28 miles away. 28 minutes away with 9% think when you get a tesla you think oh they got superchargers everywhere they don't they do not they don't it's a nice little car it drives itself i'm honestly it's hands free right now look at it we are cruising we coasting we doing it headed to 55th y'all know they don't call wait tilt it y'all know they don't call me 55th because of for nothing i was thinking they had a charger where i was and baby they did it so i'm gonna buy them right now i'm gonna buy them. i got 13 minutes left my car is on four percent it's on four <laughs> percent and it says when I reach to the destination, I'm going to have 1%. It did say zero because I was flying. Well, I wasn't flying. But in order to reach a destination, you got to go to speed limit. Who go to speed limit? Mm. So we're in a bind. So I'm just, I'm trying to get to the charger. All right. 10 minutes in. 10 minutes in. 10 minutes in. Tilt it. Tilt it. Tilt it. 10 minutes in. All right. I'm going to get there on 1%. We're looking good. Everything looking good. We're coasting. 67 and a 60. All is well. Woo! Now, the situation at hand is priorities. <laughs> the situation at hand is priorities. I, I know. You know, when I'm at home in Houston, through the grace of God, I thank you. We have a charger at the crib, so I don't have to have these worries. However, when you come to different cities and different states and different festivities, you got to pay to play. And I am in that situation right now. Oh, they're going to late. I should stop over there, huh? I should have stopped over there. Baby, I can't stop nowhere with this situation, this situation I got going on here. We nine minutes away. We nine minutes in. We nine minutes in. I'm holding on to the car like. Ladies and gentlemen, we are in a serious crisis right now. Serious crisis. I'm staying below the speed limit that they have anticipated for me. And it's going pretty well. Because at first when I was flying, it said the car. <laughs> My accent is horrible. It's cool. They said that. I gotta get off. I gotta get off. Oh, you gotta get off. Oh, I gotta get off. Get me over here. I be scared to use a blinker. It's gonna use the battery. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. What we doing? Come on. Come on. All right. I'm getting off on East 55th. Okay, we seven minutes away. Seven minutes away. East 55th. Okay, let's get it. The speed limit ten miles out. I'm on three percent. The speed limit ten to do. Where are you going ten miles out? Yeah. yeah! Yeah! First of all, give him honor to God who's the head of my life. Yes, he is. I want to thank my mama for having me. I want to thank my old lady for being with me. I want to thank everybody in the universe who prayed for me, man. I don't know how I went from New Orleans accent to a Jamaican accent. Nobody will ever know. Made it to the supercharger. Life is great, man. It's about to be beautiful. Cleveland, I love you from the bottom of my heart. Cleveland, cuzzo. <laughs> and I just want to let y'all know I'm going to be like to state my intentions I love to state my intentions I love to let people know exactly what it is So I feel like I should clarify this for someone who's watching this And are like I thought you stopped doing mukbangs I'm at the point to my life where I don't justify things But I do like to clarify things the series Beyond the Table was created by me, of course, through the grace of God, Cuzzo AB, where I shed light on businesses that people normally wouldn't go to, but people should know about. A lot of people are like, are you still doing mukbangs? I'm so confused. I thought you left mukbangs. I did. Those aren't mukbangs. This is a series that I created going beyond the table, and we're focusing on the food. We're focusing on others' brands, and we're shedding light on those businesses that I think you should know about. So if you have a business that I should go to, especially in Houston, Cause that's where I live at, but Houston Cuzzo, period. If you have a business, man, tell them to hit me up on Instagram or drop it in the comments right now so I can go and shed light on those businesses. So, no, these aren't mukbangs. This is a series of food reviews at restaurants that I think you should know about. Again, out of that season of justification, but as your favorite Cuzzo, I like to give you clarification. <laughs> I'm not using big words, boy. 
boy, I'm out here using big words. Yes, I am ADHD. Yes, I do talk a lot of bullshit. Yes, 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 yes. I probably got like a thousand personalities. Everybody be like, cuz. <laughs> I got a million personalities, baby. I do. Some days I'm chill. Some days I'm funny. Some days I'm loud. You know what I am? Me. Me. But I made it to the charge. <laughs> got me a nice little outfit in the back for the boot for the boot tonight. About to be a good night in Cleveland. Y'all you know, get these little vlogs. Hey, cuz I love the vlogs or whatever. I ain't even no structure to them. I ain't no, this is me. This is I. And guess what we still are? Beyond the table. <laughs> I don't know. I don't even know. Sometimes I don't even know why the hell y'all like me. But I'm glad you do. <laughs> Made it to the charger though, 16% moving fast. <sighs> Shall see ya. Let's get it. Where you been and where you hiding? I know you're lying. Don't you try it, no. You really shouldn't play with fire. Put it out with water. But now you're drowning. There's been a whole lot of trying, whole lot of crying, whole lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you, but I don't wanna be like you. There's been a whole lot of trying, whole lot of crying, whole lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you, but I don't wanna be like you. Yo, what up, what it is, what it do? This is your favorite color, we're in our world minute, and I'm super duper excited. Thank you, Rena, for everything that you do. Tell we getting a house painted per my idea per arena's idea and that is fire you got a brand wherever you go but you always know what's wrong with everyone else how is that you gonna have to call your friends tell them that you're gonna be late because i'm gonna need you to explain there's been a whole lot of trying, whole lot of crying, whole lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you, but I don't wanna be like you. There's been a whole lot of trying, whole lot of crying, whole lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you. Bro, it's like two o'clock in the morning. I was about to go get me some tacos. Then I was up in there editing and I was like, I ain't even explain what the hell was going on in the crib. Like, so we decided when we got back, like to just paint the walls and just make it like a make make it like a vibe, like make it ours. So that's what you just seen in that footage right there. But I don't know, it's just two o'clock in the morning. And I was just kind of just just thinking to myself and just thinking about, you know what I'm saying? Though, like what I wanna do and like how I wanna do it and what I'm about to do with myself and just everything. You know what I'm saying though? And I was talking to God the other day, like for real. And he just told me to like be still. Stay still. You know what I'm saying? Stay still. And that, that's just it really like resonated with me. Because a lot of times, man, we put so much emphasis on trying to be perfect and we put so much pressure on ourselves and trying to be sometimes something that we not that we really forget who we are and like what we really want to do with our lives because we're so worried about other people and what they're going to think and trying to be a perfectionist and trying to make all of these moves and trying to get the money, get the money, get the money, get the money, get the money. And sometimes, man, you really just got to like stay still. Like stay still. That thing dark ain't it. Come here. Let me talk to you. Sometimes you really just, you just really got to stay still and got that pink hat back there baby don't ask sometimes you really just gotta stay still in order to just listen to the spirit and listen to yourself and listen to your good you know what i'm saying though a lot of times you could be so focused on other things and trying to get other things done that you forget about what your purpose is you know what i'm saying though and me like i, I just ain't gonna hold you i've been living my best life baby i've been man i i ain't been studying no youtube i haven't studying no people i haven't studying no instagram this season for me has really just been about self and I ain't gonna even hold you. A lot of people may say I have been I have been very selfish. I have been. I feel like for me, man, I took care of so many people like mentally, physically, emotionally, financially, that a lot of those times like I neglected myself. So in this season, it's about self. 
And I have been very selfish with my time, with my energy, with, you know, saying where I put myself and how much time I preserve for myself. And I feel like that's been very important in this journey. But a lot of times we could be so overwhelmed with the stuff that we got to do that we lose track of what we have to do and what we want to do for ourselves. So I was just editing that. And I was like, now I forgot to tell cuz like we... You know what I'm saying? What we was doing in the house and getting the wall together and stuff. Because we decorate the house. We got interior decorators and stuff pulling up. But I was just, the spirit was just on my heart to just stay still. You know what I'm saying? And with, with my channel and stuff, like I just been doing some stuff. I got a lot of stuff I need to edit. I really, really do. But I do want to just drop these random vlogs in between the beyond the table in between what I'm what I'm doing and how I'm doing it. And drop these random vlogs because Cuzzle AB started because I was in y'all words inspiring and motivating and I, I don't want to lose that part of myself because that's honestly who make me who I am feeding into you it feeds me you know what I'm saying no so in this process of me just trying to start over with this blank canvas with my channel and stuff trying different stuff I do want to continue to drop these what what made me who I am you know what I'm saying the motivation and inspiring and just giving you a good word and the word today was just honestly just be still you know what I'm saying? No, I honestly started this vlog like a week ago when I was in Cleveland. That was just like some random stuff that y'all seen in the beginning. Came home, but I do want to get into vlogging. I do want to get into just sharing my life and what I do behind the scenes and stuff. Kabo, I'm really funny. <laughs> but it's 2 o'clock in the morning, so my energy level is depleted right now. But stay still, man. You know what I'm saying? In this life, what you doing and how you doing it. Just stay still. Sometimes you really got to stay still, listen to yourself so you can honestly hear, hear, you know what I'm saying, what it is that you want to do. But sometimes you can't hear that because of all the chaos around you. And the, is that Rena's pink hat? Who's pink hat? It's Rena hat. But just stay still, you know what I'm saying? No, but everything will be okay. Whatever your struggle is right now, whatever it is, man, stay still. So you can listen to what it is that you have to do for yourself, you know. But like I said, I do want to start dropping more vlogs like this and just being random, being random. Because y'all remember when I used to have a vlog channel, the vlog channel was... This camera is jacked up. I know it because my face ain't supposed to be that damn big in this camera. No, it's not. But the vlog channel, y'all remember because I had my vlog channel, I was just, just vlog random stuff. But that's all I wanted to share with y'all before I end this vlog, before I end this night. Hopefully, Rena is up here cooking something. I think she's cooking something. So, I'm about to go see. Because I was about to go get me some tacos. Then, I remember I had to charge the car. But, at least here it's free, baby. At least, at least here I could just live my life and do what it is I do by itself and go on upstairs. But, stay still, man. You know? Don't worry about people's expectations. People going to talk regardless. Don't worry about... Honestly, just wake up today. Pray. And hustle harder, man. You know, hustle harder, making sure you take taking care of yourself. Me, baby, I done lost a little weight. I've been eating clean. I'm thinking about going back to the gym, but I don't know if I am. But I've been thinking about it. But <laughs> taking care of yourself is a priority, man. But stay still. So I'm about to go up here and see what Rena cooking. And I'm about to go up here and see what Rena cooking. Girl, that's all I got. Let me grab my balloon. I got the TV all in the people's face like the TV ain't loud as hell. <laughs> You cooking fish tacos? Huh? Cooking fish tacos? No, something I made. I don't know what I'm cooking yet. I'm just letting the seasoning flow through my stuff. There go this wall right here. They go Arena cooking fish tacos. You keep saying tacos, but I don't know what I'm cooking. <laughs> I don't even know what you're cooking. Yeah. And it's that hustle wall. That's a big ass piece of fish. Yeah. The plastic stuff. Bring me out the plastic. I've been acting brand new. I've been acting brand new. Hey. hey. <laughs> I do not know what I mean. This is I'm not a, my fancy TV dinner. This is not a TV dinner. First of all, this is a jerk tilapia <laughs> with a bag of mashed potatoes. I like, I'm about to eat it. I'm about to. It's a bed of mashed potatoes for me, boo. Oh, yeah. Oh, I gave you a plastic fork. No, I like the fork. It's 3 o'clock in the morning. <laughs> Let me tell you something. 
It's three o'clock in the morning. We do not eat gourmet. We eat easy, accessible, and easy to wash. That's fine. Oh, damn! What it was? I thought it was the air fryer. Mm. That fish hit. I've never had jerk fish. Crying, whole lot of telling me I should be dying or be like you, but I don't.